Hey there guys and gals and welcome back to another tutorial on how to do things correctly. Um, what this tutorial is going to explain is how to record your voice audio chat with a friend and stream your gameplay as well. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to go ahead and go to your uh, web browser. Um, sorry, that's not what you need yet. Um, you're going to go ahead and go to the Elgato website and download the latest... Um, latest version of the Elgato which is right here um, as you can tell I tried looking up tutorials on how to do this and I couldn't find anything so hopefully you guys will come into luck right now I am recording with my Elgato um, so what you're gonna go ahead and do is go to uh, download and support and then you're gonna go ahead and download whatever Elgato uh, software you need for your Elgato for me I have the Elgato HD so I'm going to go ahead and download this one and it's going to bring you over to a site and you just uh, download the, load, the latest software and uh, after that you should be good to go. And so without further ado, now that we have the Elgato and the sound capture that you guys downloaded, what you're going to want to do is you're going to open up the sound capture. For me it's right here, it's minimized. And then you're going to go ahead and go to team chat. But before you do that, you're going to go ahead and right click and go to playback devices and make sure you set this as default uh, and default communications. That way, uh, when you record, the Elgato actually hears you record as well. Um, another thing that you're going to want to do is go ahead and set this to your default mic and your default uh, headset to wherever you want to hear your friends chat. And um, like, for instance, if I wanted to call my friend Bob. Um, the Elgato wouldn't be able to hear him unless uh, you had this set over here, but you wouldn't be able to hear him unless you had it set to the device that you want it for. So for me, it's going to be my Razer mic and the headset, which is, thank you, Razer. <laughs> Sorry for the tapping, but I like my headset. Um, so after that, you're going to go ahead and click OK. And after you set this up, you're going to go ahead and minimize this. Pull up... Um, Another thing, uh, for instance, here it is. Uh, you're going to go ahead and go to uh, settings for your, um, whether or not it's Skype or Curse or anything else. All of them is going to, they're all going to have the same thing. They're all going to have the same audio settings. So what you're going to go ahead and do is go ahead to audio. <laughs> Leave your DeFi, uh, device set as your microphone. But here's the catch. For your speakers and headset device, you're going to go ahead and click that to make sure it's speakers audio sound capture if you don't have that uh, selected the Elgato is not going to know what to do with it um, so for instance so if I wanted to go ahead and test the Elgato sound capture now that you have it set over here uh, now that you have it set over here you're gonna go ahead and play test sound and as you can tell it automatically picked up in the Elgato sound capture not the game audio now for the game audio, I had to look up a few tutorials for that because of the fact that I am recording with my Elgato on my laptop. And for some reason, the Elgato sound and the game audio, it doesn't know what to do because of the fact that it's just, it, it's, it's lost in translation. Because when you go to settings, it's selected as other. There is no PC. So what you're going to have to do is go ahead, go back to your web browser and go to this website here, which is voice meter, or you can go to Google and type in voice meter and it should come up with VB audio software. So what you go ahead and do is you go ahead and scroll down, click on download. You can either download the zip package or the exe file. The exe file is actually more, you know, you can actually install it right from your web browser if you're lucky. Um, you don't have to unzip it and you know, rummage through a RAR file. You can just download it and install it through the EXE file. Then you, after that, you install it. You're going to go ahead and go back up to the Virtual Audio Cable tab, which is that, which is at the top of the page. You're going to go ahead and scroll down and click on Download, and then you're going to go ahead and install that software. Now, when you do this, you're going to have to restart your computer, but don't do that yet because of the fact that you're going to want to go ahead and... and uh, uh, set up the settings for the uh, virtual uh, voice meter. So the voice meter, now this is my settings because of the fact that I haven't 
changed over to the Elgato, you can more than likely copy this if you want. I use this for DXTory and it helped me a lot. So what you're going to want to do is go ahead and set the um, your first one to um, your headset, which I have right now. As you can tell, I'm talking as we are recording. Then you're going to go ahead and set your second one to the cable output. Now there's two of them. If the first one doesn't work for you, go ahead and go for the second one. And what I mean by it doesn't work, it's going to sound all, it's going to sound uh, like it's got Tourette's or it, it's stuttering. There you go. Perfect example. If it's stuttering, if it stutters on WDM, go ahead and select the MME. You'll hear it when you record. Just do a software recording or something like that. A five second recording of music or something. You'll hear it if it, if it messes it up. After that, this right here is uh, where everything is going to be previewed through. So uh, this is all the audio. Like if I were to go ahead and select a video or something like that, I'm going to go ahead and select a random video. Um, this is my channel. I've got 239 subscribers. Thank you guys. And 708 views. But this is my channel. I'm going to go ahead and click on a random video and you guys are going to hear it in the recording as well. But I want you to pay attention to, I have to um, do, this is a mobile defense, so all I have to do is just put a, 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 a frost shield. That's weird. Um, <laughs> that shouldn't have happened. If you need it should be actually going to the game. Oh, I know why. Because in my game, I have it set to somewhere else. I have it set to the VB cable as default. So what you're going to want to do is go ahead and go to recording devices. And then set that as your default, I think. Possibly. Maybe. <laughs> We're not going to do that just yet. Don't worry about this. This is just something else. Um, I don't know why I did that. Oh, I did it for voice meter. That's right. <laughs> um, so you can just stay inside it. But I'm going to be hanging yeah. around you anyway, so. Okay. Well, that's not working out the well I as well as I thought it was going to. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about any of that. Just skip that part. Right now, the only thing we were doing is trying to get our, our uh, software to record gaming and our ch friends chat. So whatever I just previewed, don't worry about that. I'll probably just cut that out anyway. Um, so what you're going to want to do is go ahead and select your game after you go into uh, recording. Make sure you set this as default communication. Make sure you set this as the uh, default device. Click OK. Then in your game options, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go ahead and select that and audio into your voice meter input VB audio voice meter cable thingy. Not the VB cable, but the voice meter cable. Then click confirm. And to see that this is working in the game audio, this is me talking through here, but this is the game talking right here. Uh, so, me talking here, game voice, or game audio, sorry. <laughs> so, to make sure everything worked, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and leave that over here. Now that we have that confirmed that this is actually going through the game audio of the Elgato, we're going to go ahead and do it one more time and confirm that we are um, recording our friends' voices through the speakers of the Elgato, which is right here. And there you go. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I hope this guys uh, I hope this worked out for you guys. I really do appreciate your guys' support, and I'm glad you guys you know view my channel and make sure you guys you know comment, like, and subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free to message me by going to my channel, which is right here. Um, ah, which is right here. Just go to the About tab and then send me a message, which you guys probably won't see because of the fact that. Um, this is viewing as me. So, um, yeah, so the uh, send message will be up here in this corner up here. Either or, don't forget to send me a message. Uh, if you have any questions, I'll, f I'll, I'll take my time to answer them. I'll do my best to answer them as best as I can. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So, GG guys, have a good one, and see you next time.